Kada, Menteri Besar Muhammad Sanusi Matnoor wants the federal constitution to be amended to back his claim that Penang belongs to Kada. He told news portal FMT that historical and academic studies supported his claim that Kada owned Penang. With this, he called for the current generation to rectify the distortion of history and amend the federal constitution accordingly. He reportedly said that given that the federal constitution can be amended in parliament to accommodate present needs, why should the discovery of strong evidence be disregarded simply because of what is written in the constitution? He added that the only things in this world that cannot be amended are the Quran and Hadith. He said Ram Karpal Singh or anyone else can say anything they like, and he was free to comment as well so long as what he said is not illegal. Sanusi added that he did not appreciate baseless claims, questioning his understanding of the federal constitution or that he had undermined the supreme law of the land. He said he would accept a court decision as the final solution, but refused to be silenced or have his views suppressed. Yesterday, Ram Karpal, who is a deputy minister in the Prime Minister's Department for Law and Institutional Reform, said Penang is a sovereign state in Malaysia and its legal position cannot be disputed. He said since British rule, Penang has been acknowledged as a straight state under the grouping known as the Straits Settlements. Subsequently, he said several agreements, including the Federation of Malaya Agreement, were signed with Kedah and the British also clearly acknowledged Penang as a sovereign state. He said this in response to Sanusi's claim on Monday that Kedah and Penang had no borders as Penang belonged to Kedah.